Good day guys, Dr. Plo here and welcome to my channel. First of all, I would like to say thank you, thank you very much. I have reached or we have reached the road to 100, 200 subscribers and I appreciate it very much to each and everyone that subscribed to my channel. Thank you very much guys, I really appreciate it. For those that are watching my videos but are not subscribed, please guys subscribe. I really need you guys and you are the majority that are watching my video but are not subscribed. So please, don't be shy to check in and to sign in and subscribe to my channel. I really appreciate it. Without further ado, today I would like to discuss what's in my bag and the most important thing as far as making these videos is concerned is this, the camera body. I bought the second hand from another lady somewhere in Cape Town, it's the Canon 650D, it's a 18 megapixel camera, I've been having it for two years now, this is the second year. I upgraded from the 1200D to this one because I needed a flip out screen to see myself especially when I'm making videos and another thing was the mic input very important as far as making videos is concerned because your quality need to be it needs to be clear people need to hear you yeah so that was the two most important things that made me upgrade from the 1200D which is also a Canon to the Canon 650D I just needed proper sound and I need to and I needed to see myself as far as framing and composition was concerned so yeah guys there's the camera this camera is it's a crop sensor for those of you that don't know it's you get in the camera realm you get micro four third sensors you get crop sensors super 35 you get full frame and you get medium format so this is a crop sensor it's on the cheaper side from full frame yeah but it takes decent video and that is why I think I'll be still using it into next year as far as making videos is concerned. On the photo side, this camera is just as good. Although it's an older camera, but it's focus, it's focus, it's focusing for photography, it's very good. I've been shooting a lot of photos with it, testing it. I even shot some nighttime photography and they came out beautifully with this camera. And yeah, so in case you want a camera for starters on the video side, rather get a camera with a flip out screen and a mic and a mic jack input for for sound purposes. So yeah, that's the body I use for photography and videography. And second of all, also very important, it's useless to just have a body without having proper lenses. So my favorite lens that I like to use on this camera is the Canon 17 to 55, which I'm currently using on the camera right now to record this video, and it's a it's a fast lens. The f the aperture goes down to f 2.8, and it's a USM motor, which means it's very silent. And the filter size or the the size for filters on this camera is 77 millimeter, which I'll show you later on in the video what is the ND filter and what's the purpose of it. So yeah, this is my lens, it's a, it's a zoom lens, so you can stay in one place, zoom into something and zoom out again to get, to get certain perspectives. So yeah, it's a very good lens, it has stabilization on it, which makes, which cuts out a lot of that jittery stuff when you shoot video handheld. So yeah, that's one of the reasons why I love this lens so much. Although I fell with it in the river there in Bloomer, I almost damaged my lens, but it's partly damaged, but it's still working fine as far as zooming and focusing is concerned. So I don't think I'll ever sell this lens. It's going to be with me for as long as I love doing this. And for my next lens is the Canon 50 millimeter. This is a beauty as far as portraits are concerned if you're into photography 
you really need to get this lens because it's gonna make you look like you've been doing this for years that's the beauty of this 50 mil but on this crop sensor is the equivalent of a 85 millimeter so the minute you put it on you need to step back you can't be up close to certain things you need to step back to take the type of photos you want but it will also teach you how to compose and work with it take photos move back and forth yeah it will just push your creativity so this 50 mil is the type of lens you use in in tough situations yeah it will teach you how to be a photographer it will teach you how to use your third eye how to compose and yeah so that's the why that's that's why i love this lens so much it's very sharp it goes one down to f 1.8 it gives you the nice blurry background if you're into blurry backgrounds so yeah that's why i love this lens and fourth after having all the setup your lenses and your camera body very next important thing as far as video or creating videos is concerned is sound you really need proper sound because no one is going to watch your video when your footage is nice but your sound is crappy so yeah guys sound is very important you need to invest in it i bought buy a mic from take a lot that i use when i'm whenever i'm outside and in cases like this when i'm sitting down i'm using this left mic yeah so i have a external mic from boya and a left mic from boya so it just depends in this case i like the sound of the boya mic in the house the left mic i usually use the the onboard mic outside because it has a dead cat something to cut the wind whenever the wind is blowing yeah so it's useless to have the best footage and the worst sound so i would advise each and every one of you to invest in sound if you want to go into film making or video making as far as youtube is concerned and another thing very important guys it's memory cards you can have the whole setup but if you don't have a memory card you won't be having any footage or you will never shoot anything so it's also important for you to invest in memory cards because video takes a lot of space and yeah i have what five memory cards i have an eight eight gig that came with the previous camera i had and i bought three 16 gigs while i was still full time into photography and when i start to dabble in video those memory cards was just getting full fast then i decided to buy a 128 gig a gigabyte memory card so yeah i'm currently using the 128 gig because yeah it takes a lot of time before it fills up so yeah that's it guys and it's also useless to have all these memory cards but you don't have anything to back it up to that is why i use the samsung hard drive it's a one terabyte hard drive it's almost full also i must start investing into more hard drives to back up my footage so yeah guys it's very important for you to have extra storage to back up your stuff in case a memory card fail and all those things and yeah that's most of it and last on the list since i'm busy with my evolution from photography to video i hardly use this this is a canon 430x ex flash and i've been having it for four years now and for for this year and last year i hardly used it i hardly used it so i feel it's just it's just filling up my bag and yeah no i don't really need it in my bag so i think i'll be selling it soon to invest into lighting for for different types of the day like for now i'm using natural light if the sun is gone i can't record anymore otherwise my footage will be all grainy and stuff so 
that is why i want to invest in lights to up my video production so yeah that's all for now guys and there's other accessories which is not necessary for now but at some other point maybe whenever i'm out there shooting a production video like mzanzi food food adventures i don't know if you checked it out but please check it out mzanzi food adventures if ever i shoot another production like that i will use my phone to make a short video of the setup we are using how we set it up for sound and everything so yeah that's all for now so if you're interested in buying a flashlight from me don't be scared to email me thank you guys for watching i really appreciate it let's let's push to our next target which is a road 2000 subscribers and i really appreciate you please share this link of my of my channel and my videos with your friends and families and tell them to subscribe i appreciate each and every one of you for coming love you guys peace